It's one of those things when you're a kid, you get interested in something, and my something was lizards. The overarching theme of my research with lizards is trying to understand how they accelerate. Nobody's really looked at that in lizards, and our hope is to start looking at species throughout the world. The summer research with Carissa is looking at how having and then losing a tail affects how lizards run. What we do is really interesting. It's kind of a lot of math and physics-based calculus in addition to the biology aspect of it. This lizard has some chalk glands that you can see on the back of its head here. Probably the two technologies I use the most are high-speed video. By collecting 10 times as many frames per second, uh, you can watch what the lizard does in slow motion. The other main technology that I use is something called a force plate, which allows you to measure the forces that the animal pushes against the ground with. What we do with CT scanning is we send the specimens down to MUSC and they use, it's called a CT scanner. It essentially takes something like a series of x-rays. And you can go through each image and build a 3D model of the bone. And with that model, we can plug it into a computer model to see how the animals would behave in different situations. After you've done a lot of work building the bone models, it's kind of tedious when you're doing it, but once you've got a final product, it's really neat. Carissa in particular, she has learned, she's probably learned more techniques than any undergraduate I've ever had the opportunity to work with. A lot of what we do is computer-based. I've learned a lot of new software programs. It's really nice to be uninterrupted over the summer because working in a lab during school year just gets really hectic. But when you're doing it over the summer, you can just focus on exactly what it is that you're doing. Students show up with new ideas. They show up with a fresh perspective on questions and procedures that I've been doing for years and sort of help me to see things in different ways and help me to move forward. And so that, that's, I think, a really positive impact for both me and the student.